Hello everybody, welcome back to more Let's Play Banjo-Kazooie. I'm your host, Scarflames, and welcome back This is the last episode. Okay, enough of that. In the last episode, we uh, completed summer, and we started fall. That's going to be a trend here in a while, and you notice... What, what the heck? I could see outside the hive. And the Zubbubs are not attacking me, so uh, we're all cool now. We already took their honey piece, and now they're all depressed because winter's coming. So let's get out of that depressing, depressing place and continue forth on our epic adventure. <clears throat> Again, climbing up the tree. This becomes very repetitive. All right, so now up here, you'll notice the house is almost finished, except, is it? I think there's a corner missing somewhere. The I could have sworn there's like a tiny piece that wasn't that was missing. Okay, never mind. The house is complete. It looks amazing, and uh, yeah, this looks fun. That you probably should have finished before summer, but <laughs> whatever. Um, there's nothing on the house, not yet. So nothing left up there except a golden feather and a worm. And now you'll notice, ah, oh yeah, this is what I was talking about. This is almost complete except one or two panels. Like, they got lazy, like, at the last bar, and like, I don't want to finish this. That's usually how I feel. But anyway, there's our friend Navnuts. He's skinny again. Darn. I need six acorns before winter comes. Can you find any? So, let's help this sad guy out. And he doesn't even notice that inside his... Oh, wait. Yeah, inside his house, there's an acorn, so, uh, apparently he's dumb, eno dumb enough not to look on his own cabinet where he stored them. Any anyway, you just give them to him, you need six of them, so five more to go. Keep looking! Sheesh, we're doing this. You, you never offered us a jiggy, you just said, do this for me, and we're just like, oh, okay. Ah, crap. How come I didn't ground pound that time? So anyway, back here, trying not to fall down. Let's try and grab them acorns again. This time, before I attempt suiciding again, I think I'll grab this one up here, because it's much closer and better to get to. So we got that one, and we landed. Aw, yeah. That's actually going to be a tricky one to get for uh, those who don't play well. I don't know. It was hard for me, it's hard for you, probably. Right? So, uh, yeah, you can each give them individually. I usually give them all, all at once. And, uh, you know, I'm just like, yeah, I feel pretty pro at this. Anyway, we break down his window, and uh, he's got water in a tree. There's like a huge, there's a huge lake in his tree. What, what the heck? This must not be water. It must be sap. We're swimming in sap. That's fun to say. Sap. This is a sap. Yeah, it's just water. Makes no sense. Hmm. Anyway, here's your nuts, Mr. Nabnut. Nabba nubba 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 nup. And we got more of these evil demons of discord. Oh, and the switch to winter! So, uh, yeah, we unlocked all four areas of Click Clock Woods. That's gonna be, um, fun. If you ever want to return here, I don't know, see why. Alright, big fella, looks like you could use a peeping host of, uh, honey bathed, barbecue glazed, uh, the uh, smoky grill, fresh out of the oven, um, worms. They're very delicious. So, uh, here you go. And yes, you do have to sit through all this.
All right. And after like a couple minutes later, he's gonna grow even bigger. <laughs> Thank you, bear. Very soon, be big bird. Must have sleep first. Ugh. <laughs> Did you see that? It moved Banjo just a tiny bit. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. And now he's. And we can't even get past him. He's that huge. We can't walk past his beak. He's a. Uh, and look, he's still a baby for him. This is gonna be great when he grows up, right? I mean, I've heard all the stories about other animals eating their mother, but, uh. <laughs> you don't think that'll happen, right? Anyway, what I missed was down here, they put. Look, they, ha they have this bridged off area that has no use, it's just there. I don't know if it gets finished later on. Um, I'll be corrected later then. Yippee, that's all the acorns I need. Here, take this. I'll see you in spring. Yep, there goes our friendly squirrel nab nuts who loves and adores acorns. You know, why are acorns? Are they. Like. Are acorns. Oh, we missed the water. Like, acorns. Are they nuts? Well, yeah, they're nuts, but, uh. Well, why are they called acorns? Why not just, like, acorn nuts or something? Maybe. Maybe I just not smart and not know the definitions of nuts, and I don't study nuts, so I wouldn't know. Anyway, now that we have finally beaten spring and all its springing autumnness, we now enter winter. And build a snowman. Do, 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 do. Why were the f what the? Did you see that? The enemies were like frozen for the first part. Weird. Anyway, this uh, level's much more easy to walk around. This is actually one of the most easy parts of the level, except for the snowman. They are pretty annoying. But, uh, yeah, you got hills going everywhere. Um, I think that still hurts you, but still. And you, now you can fly, so no need for bees. <laughs> Alright, so what's his excuse? Where is he? Mumbo's on vacation, you hairy fool. Come back in spring. I'll kill him! But, yeah. So, I guess he went on vacation. Because it's a wet old to cold. So, yeah, just feathers up there in case you need some for flying. But, considering we haven't flown for, uh... Not in... Not... Not forever, actually. It's been forever since we've gone. Anyway, there's actually something on top of his head this time. It's the blue Jinjo, and I unlocked the gamer picture. Bear went gamer pick to spruce up gamer profile. Nice. Anywho, ignoring that gamer picture, we uh, will continue forth. And we got more of these icicle things that I don't like. Oh, dude, he hit me. He hit me, and it did nothing. It just bounced off. That's weird. Alright, so now we can fly. Hell, look, an X. What do we do with Xs? We entirely miss and have to turn around. Oh, okay. Uh, whatever. And now we totally miss the X. <laughs> okay, let's, uh... Let's back up a bit so we can get some room. And uh, we miss again. Okay. We'll, uh, we'll try this again. All right. One more time, one more time, one more time. Oh, 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 no, oh. Yeah, okay, this is going to be harder than I thought. Like I said, it's the easiest level, uh, but for those snowmen. Oh well. And you'll notice our flower is dead. We will have to do some backtracking here because I didn't actually get the jiggy when I actually grew it. So we'll have to uh, get the jiggy because I originally thought that, like, oh, we can't reach it from here. So we'll have to wait till uh, winter and then I'll fall to the ground and I'll pick it up. Nope, that doesn't happen anytime soon. Anyway, oh, it's right him in the forehead. Alright, and we landed. Pretty cool. Sweet. 
They, uh, they, for some, for some reason, hitting their hats off kills them. Okay. I, I, I've seen enough things that I stopped questioning these things. Alright, and we land again. <laughs> I don't want to land, but still, it looks pretty cool how I just gently put my feet on the ground. Oh, that's also something. Um, with the variations of the level comes the variations of music. And uh, each has their own sort of pattern. You may have already noticed or something like that. But to me, spring is my favorite because it's more high beat and it's just like, yeah, welcome to a new world level, people. I hope you enjoy it. And uh, I love how... Uh, What's his name? Koji? No, Koji. Grant something or another. His name's Grant, who makes all the all the rare songs. Grant Chrisoff or something like that. But yeah, he, he does well at matching um, the mood of the place. Oh, whoa. That was some major matrix there. And you notice that the snowman will not hit you if you're close enough. They'll just sit there like, oh, I can't do a thing. I'm just gonna bounce up and down. Anyway, when you see Gruntilda, smash her in the face. And you get a jiggy, and you're like, wait, how do we, how do we get out there? That's that's in the la, uh, that's in the place where uh, we uh, there's a cow, no, a bowl, a bowl that uh, oh look. <laughs> <laughs> I have a weird laugh. Look at that! The the beaver, he's still under there! He, wouldn't he be frozen under all this ice? Like, seriously. He was really... He can't wait, he can't find a new home. He has to sit there and wait for someone to open his home. That's... that's commitment, I tell you that. I tell you what. Now, sorry. Uh, we're at the very top now. It's great how you can fly around. And look at our beautiful baby. We'll get to her later. I want to say it's a girl because I don't know. It looks more like a girl to me. Eerie. Doesn't that sound like a girl name or a boy name? I can't tell. Actually, in a Chinese class, yes, I do take Chinese, um, we, we, uh, did this little activity where we had to guess the age and write it in Chinese, of course, but, uh, we had to guess the age of Asian people, and every time I was, like, so off, I thought a 28-year-old was 16, I'm like, what? And it's, the teacher even threw me off like she's in a school uniform. I'm like, oh, she must like be 16 or 17 or something. Anyway, end of the video. Goodbye. See ya.